Hello and welcome back. So in this final video of uh, Google Certificate series, we are going to look at Google IT automation with Python professional certificate. Uh, this one is a great course, especially it adds so much value to your resume. Uh, let's check out the courses and you can see that uh, it I basically it's Python. Python is pretty hot right now. Everybody is looking for it. The other one is Git and GitHub. You actually get to see what the these uh, this uh, is, and you actually get to make your repository there. And you you can there's a neat calendar. You can pretty much add this to your portfolio and show uh, this. And then the other one I. The little bit touches the cloud, and cloud does have. Um, when I was doing the AWS, uh, learning the just the basics, uh, basically there is a repo there as well for develop developers. So if you have an idea through GitHub, you can see what the private uh, Git looks like and how it works. So and these these are the tasks you can add to your portfolio and you know later brag about them in the um, interviews so actually uh, very shamefully I did start it back in September haven't gotten to finish it yet and haven't even finished the first course the there were some like major life events that I, I um, got a new job, got a new home. We had to go through the moving, buy new furniture. So a lot was going on and I, you know, uh, at the end of the day, I was not. And then I wanted to pay more attention to Network Plus rather than this course. So uh, obviously it got neglected. That I'm not proud of. I strongly feel that I should have completed it. Uh, I intend to in this summer so <clears throat> let's check this labels uh, I did go through like a little bit maybe just the first week again and <laughs> not proud of it even though I'm giggling uh, but you can see here uh, I enjoyed it a lot the first one uh, it brought uh, back the memories when I was learning C uh, C++ and it uh, basically last year last year during COVID in summer I took SQL I taught myself SQL so yeah this course like I was just looking going through it um, uh, in February or January and it brought up that uh, stay same feeling where you want to <clears throat> actually manipulate the code and get it to uh, work or figure out things that hey okay hey this is how it gets done so you can see this six weeks in the first uh, one and again you can pretty much if you're dedicated and if you have in a couple of hours uh, you can pretty much uh, complete it so you can see it even though it's saying five hours to complete the week one but the video is only 44 44 minutes and through the videos and where they are demonstrating what's the code or ma manipulation or how to write the syntax there are five readings normally they are just either links or just uh, a recap of what uh, they have said in the video so four quizzes are basically this quizzes uh, be mindful this quiz is not your knowledge of theory these are the quizzes where they will actually give you the code or ask you to write uh, give you the code to fix it or ask you the code for a problem so even though they are like one-liners uh, especially in week one they, they that's how they right off the bat it's coding I really enjoyed it you, sh you will too let's go to the second course there <clears throat> and second course again how many weeks uh probably six weeks okay so oh seven all right so e, this one is a little bit on the um, 
longer side of uh, normal Google courses because uh, uh, previously I remember only six weeks uh, in the Google IT sport but this one is definitely going through uh, seven weeks or probably it could hit eight weeks introduction to Git. let's see this one and then we'll wrap this up so four weeks here okay this one is only four weeks so yeah you get the idea that uh, most of them that uh, they are on the longer side uh, but it's a ton of information the good side is that if you pay attention let the information sink in you learn a lot and the downside is that uh, even if you don't pay attention just you know zip through them you still get the completion certification but like i said it's always better to uh, really understand it let it uh, all this information uh, let it sink in uh, so you can speak much better in not only interviews uh, not it's just not to brag but the thing is that based on this knowledge you can build something up something entirely wonderful for I'm gonna give you an example I work in Amazon and we have a program that uh, they take you uh, for a one-year instructor-led training of JavaScript on all of the programs that I've seen elsewhere there are the maximum I think seven uh, I was just talking to some some, some person uh, the yesterday and she mentioned that uh, the program they have that uh, they offer uh, for apprenticeship uh, is uh, 7 to 22 weeks long so either it's seven weeks or for 22 weeks based on uh, each person's like individual and 22 weeks is nothing with compared to uh, a whole year 52 weeks so basically the program uh, that we uh, an Amazon Technical Academy has is that uh, it's nine months uh, instructor led that for nine straight months you are sitting in a class and they are teaching you and the three uh, last three months you are on the job trained that's awesome and they actually pay you for that the pay is uh, 3500 per month and during that time period and the coolest thing is that you don't lose your job in that the one that you were in Amazon uh, to get to that uh, uh, technical academy so you are uh, sent on a leave from your current position and you're just uh, sitting there while being paid to be in a class can you beat that no so uh, like I said you build something on top of what you have learned here so if you know Python it's you are already in the motion you already uh, in the flow and you can go and do uh, something entirely wonderful and maybe brag a little about uh, hey I already know this I can do that so to answer your question if you have a question am I going for that JavaScript class or not I am trying I will see the outcome all right so let's wrap this video here if this video has helped you please rate comment subscribe and share and I will see you in the next one